Hi everyone, Rao sir here. Welcome to Rao's Chemistry Classes. In this video, I am going to discuss differences between lanthanoids and actinoids. This concept comes under F-block elements. So first, what are F-block elements? Just look at the board. F-block elements. The differentiating electron enters into F subcell. Differentiating electron is nothing but last electron. If last electron enters into F subcell, F orbital, that is called F block elements. If last electron F orbital me aaya to usko F block elements bolte. Okay. Next important point. F block contains how many series? It contains two series. That means two parts. Just look at the board. So here one important point, F block elements it is also called inner transition elements. D block elements is called transition elements and F block elements is called inner transition elements. F block contains two series, number one 4F series that is nothing but lanthanoids, number two 5F series that is nothing but actinoids. Next main thing. Here we need to discuss differences between lanthanoids and actinoids. Yeah, one by one. So first point, lanthanoids, it is also called rare earth elements. And rare is nothing but less abundant in nature. Less abundant in earth crust. Next, what about actinoids? What is the nickname of actinoids? Actinoids is called transuranic elements. Transuranic elements. Why this name is arrived? Simple logic. After uranium, every element is artificial element. Before uranium, natural elements. That's the reason this name is arrived. Okay, students. Next, what is the general electronic configuration of lanthanoids? And one more important point. This is belongs to 4F series. That's the reason its general electronic configuration is its general electronic configuration is 4F1 to 14. 5D 0 to 1 6S2. What about this one? This is 5F series. So here general electronic configuration becomes 5F 1 to 14 6D 0 to 1 7S2. Is it clear? Next, third point. Lanthanoids belongs to lanthanoid belongs to sixth period. The third group. Third big group. Next point, fourth point, its common oxidation state, its common oxidation state plus 3, its common oxidation state is plus 3, this point is very much important. When it comes to D block elements, D block elements common oxidation state is plus 2, F block elements common oxidation state is plus 3. What about other oxidation states? other oxidation states here other oxidation states plus 4 and plus 5 here other oxidation states plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 also is it clear less tendency towards formation of complex compounds here more tendency why because here maximum possibilities oxidation states here minimum possibilities next Lanthanoids are less basic, whereas actinoids are more basic. Whereas actinoids are more basic. Lanthanoids are less reactive, whereas actinoids are more reactive. Next. They do not form oxocations. Do not form oxocations. But they form oxocations. They form oxocations. These are the main differences. Lanthanoids and actinoids. Once again, dear students, F block elements. Two, two parts, lanthanoids and actinoids. Lanthanoids belongs to 4F series, actinoids belongs to 5F series. So it is called rare earth elements, it is called transuranic elements. Here general electronic configuration is 4F1 to 14, 5D0 to 1, 6H2. Here 5F, like that. 
Next, belongs to 6th period and 3rd B group. Belongs to 7th period and 3rd B group. Next, common oxidation state plus 3, common oxidation state plus 3. Other oxidation states plus 4 and plus 5, here plus 4, plus 5, plus 6, plus 7 also. That is the reason less tendency towards formation of complex compounds, here more tendency towards complex formation. Next, less basic and this is more basic and this is less reactive and this is more reactive and do not form oxocadians and they form oxocadians. Next, this is more shielding effect, this one shows less shielding effect. Shielding effect, screening effect, both are same, do not get confused, just look at the board. So, total F block contain how many elements? 28 elements. Out of 28 elements, lanthanoids 14 and actinoids 14. So, how to remember lanthanoids and actinoids? This is very much important. Just look at the board. Lanthanoids. Oh, how to remember lanthanoids? Simple technique. Very simple technique. LCP. NP. You have to remember like that. LCP, NP. Set, but here G silent. Detail, detail. Yeah, you have to remember like three words. LCPNP set detail. LCPNP set detail. L is nothing but lanthanum, cerium, praseodymium, neodymium, promethium, samarium, europium, gadolinium, terbium. Disposium, Holmium, Erbium, Thulium, Ederbium, Lutetium. So, you have to remember like this. So, Lanthanum atomic number 57, 58 to 71. 14 elements. Yeah. So, Lanthanum 57, it is not a F block element. It is a D block element. After Lanthanum, the series will be started like that. So, this is the first F block element. This is the first F block element. Very much important point. This is the first F block element. What is the first F block element? Cerium. What is the atomic number? 58. Next, 59, 60, 61, 62, 70, 71. You have to remember like that. Okay. So, LCP, NP, sect detail. 2-3 time practice kar automatically ajate. Yeah. Next, what about actinoids? What about actinoids? Actinoids is nothing but 5F series. Lanthanoids is nothing but 4F series. Actinoids. After actinium, it will start. Actinium atomic number 89. Next, to thorium to Laurentium. Thorium atomic number 90. Laurentium atomic number 103. So, 90 to 103, 14 elements. Yeah. How do you remember? ATP, UNP. ATP, UNP. ACBC. E, F, M, N, L. You have to remember like that. ATP, UNP. ATP, UNP. ACBC, EFM, NL. That's it. Simple logic. If you feel it is simple, it becomes very simple. If you feel it is hard, it becomes very hard. It all depends upon whether you feel simple or hard. ATP, UNP, ACBC, EFM, NL. So, A is nothing but actinium, thorium, protoactinium, uranium, neptunium, flutonium, americium, curium, berkelinium, Californium, Einsteinium, Fermium, Mendelinium, Nobolium, Laurentium. So, here actinium atomic number 89, thorium atomic number 90, like that 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103. So, you have to remember like that. Is it clear, my dear students? Yeah. So, each and everyone, please subscribe my channel and click the bell button to get further notifications. Bye for now. See you again.